Welcome to our rise in the village. But this one, the color of this one has not changed that nice. Let me take you to where the color is good. <laughs> where the color is very green. Guys, this one is Mulua village. The village that is very close to the largest lake in Africa. And that is Lake Victoria. This village is becoming popular day by day. Guys, this one is somehow green. Hmm, this one is beta. For those ones who are coming across Ogoki TV for the very first time, we do plant rice in the village. And this rice, we grow it, one, to consume locally, and then we also grow it to export it to the outside country. This is a very big canal that is supplying water to the rice plantation. We have got very big land. Are you seeing? That land, the whole of that land is just to plant rice. The whole of this one here has also been used to plant rice in the village. We are so much blessed. Happy New Year to everybody. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Remember, this New Year, before we approach New Year, one, learn the art of sharing. Share what you have with those ones who don't. Share what you have to the poor. Share what you have to those ones who are very weak health-wise, all right? And God will bless you so much. Right now, it is almost at seven in the evening. The sun, <laughs> I don't know whether, are you seeing where the sun is? So there is where the sun is. I'm just in the village with my good friend, that is Lawrence. Yesterday, I made a video with Lawrence and he was not feeling good yesterday. He was very sick. And today I have decided to have a walk with him. He do a small exercise so that his health can improve. I want him to introduce himself to you people. I don't know whether the lightings are okay or they're not okay. Okay, let me try this side. Introduction, my brother. Yes, so hello. So his name is uh, Lawrence Oenga. And then that is his sign name. And uh, I am a good friend to this brother right here. Okay, thank you so much. Guys, we are in Molua village, walking around just <laughs> to make sure that Mr. Lawrence become more energetic because yesterday he was not feeling good. So today, how are you feeling? So he's feeling somehow good, <coughs> somehow good. So tomorrow he believes he's going to become more strong, but today he's somehow weak, he's somehow good, but he believed tomorrow he's gonna be okay. Now, yesterday we purchased uh, this one. Then, have you used it? Have you used it? So he's still using that machine. So he has it here. This one is a brand new machine, guys. I you seeing here it is? Huh? It's a new machine that uh, Lawrence is using. It has This one has got a lot of gas here. Let me see the name of this one. I don't know whether it's... Is it the same with the, the, the Kitambo one? Different, am I the same? Oh, so it is just the same, but now the name is different. Okay, let me check. Uh, this one is called... Oh... So, salbutamol, eh, salbutamol pressurized inhalation, BP 100 MCG. And then down here they have written as derihela. Those ones who know how to read, I don't know whether you can try to read. Let me move this one close. Ah, this one is hard to, all right. So, I want you... Wait, people are moving fast. Okay. So, um, 
now i want you to use this thing now now show people now show people how is it used yes so it helps in breathing example if you have got chest pain this one really supports you we have got something on the screen now how do i remove it i think all right it's okay i think it's okay now hey fuck guys our screen is misbehaving okay our screen head has been misbehaving but uh, we have tried our level best to make it to make it nice okay now i want you to show people how to use this machine okay okay if you have got a problem with chest with breathing you use it then you become comfortable you become mm -hmm. so much relieved yes now use it now okay now first okay are you seeing okay 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 again again mm. okay so using it a lot of it is bad right so you just use small so the small one is enough so the last one the last one wait okay are you seeing it's enough so guys this one is a gas <laughs> if you use a lot of this gas it's very much expensive this thing here so we need not to waste it because if it gets finished okay one each one each is 550 shillings at Port Victoria it's 550 but different places it is Budalangi yes it is at 600 600 is about um, six dollars and I have got the receipt here with me by the way <laughs> I bought it at 550 Kenya shillings uh, down here my I'm using a selfie guys so it cannot it shows the letters in in an inverted way down here it shows 550 ah, anyway yeah they have already seen yeah so this thing is very much expensive you have to use it sparingly mm -mm. okay name name hey that okay franol so it's very small it's important it's okay okay so between this one and uh, and the franol important mm -hmm. or both they're both important mm -hmm. okay now this one yeah so guys this one helps in uh the franol and this one they're also just they're just they're both important in if you've got a problem with chest pain guys who are watching me from my name is alan a village boy from kenya in africa and i'm together with my brother lawrence he's a person with hearing impairment for those ones who are coming across this channel for the very first time please subscribe like the video very much important because he will be supporting the village boy and i'm telling you that in the village we do practice what's called rice planting rice plant rice growing <laughs> ah, let me take you down here again this is all about rice in the village ah. so we give it i don't know how many months so that it can mature well and then we start using it i don't know let me stand here what mm. oh, yeah guys, by the way guys the water is missing mm. Mm. Eh, guys by the way is it possible that this rice will uh, die mm -hmm. it's impossible yeah. ah. so it will just continue but you see mm -hmm. okay see wait wait see here are you seeing the level of water the water is very small you see now this water it cannot be supplied here are you seeing because you know the level of water is here right i think how the level of water is so it cannot jump <laughs> it cannot jump okay okay because the wa the water is missing but 
Okay. Mm. Yeah. If what is missing, mm. slowly, slowly. Okay. Oh, fertilizers. Okay, these ones. Mm -mm. Now, first the water, the water dries first. Then they add the fertilizers. Me, before me, I've seen people that are complaining, complaining why the water is not inside this land here. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay, mm. okay, okay. Mm. So first, so they, they added fertilizers before. Now they want to add water next. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay, okay. okay. Mm. Oh, by the way, the whole of this land is not having water because they have already added fertilizer here. So after they have added fertilizer, they will add water later. But today in the morning, people are really people are really complaining that this water is not being supplied to this rice because before me today I've interacted with uh, I've interacted with one person, right? And then he was complaining how that the water is missing why there pay bad yes i know that they are adding fertilizer first no money they have not paid for water zero yes so that that is why the water is missing here maybe they will it will die maybe guys so it is crazy here in the village you know Something very much important with rice is it requires a lot of water. So if the water misses, rice can no longer grow. Imagine. Even if you check here. Okay, with this side we have got water. But the water is very small. But you think the other side, the water, this rice is very dry. It's not even having water. So there is now where we are going to get a very big loss in the village. In fact, today in the morning I interacted with one farmer who was complaining that his land is not having water. I don't know. He's going, I don't know, to use generator to supply water to the rice plantation. Here we have got water, yes, but this other side, there's no water. No water at all. And you know, for rice to grow very well, it requires a lot of water. Just check the other side. Very much dry. Very much dry. There is no water. Just check. I don't know whether it's clear. I will try to make a very good video tomorrow while uh, showing you how dry our rice plantation is. Now guys, up to this point, we have to make our video come to an end because we don't have the sun. <laughs> what should we do? Should we continue filming and there is no sun? It's very much hard, guys. It is... A eh? Is it a Merry Christmas? <laughs> Guys, <laughs> filming and at the same time uh, using sign language is somehow hard. So I'm sorry if my hand, I'm using one hand and maybe people are like, oh, you see, you, you know, using one hand is very much hard. Understood? One hand is holding this, then the other, yes, it becomes very, very much hard. Imagine. Now it is a merry Christmas <laughs> and then a happy new year. Cindy. Okay. So I wish you wishing you a merry Christmas and happy new year 2020 2024. Guys, people are coming. We have to pave way for people to pass and then we call it the end of our today's video first. So guys, we have to call it the end of our today's video and um, in short our land, the rice plantation is missing water. There is no water at all here in the village. Imagine. Is it possible that we pray? You pray. You want to pray. <laughs> okay, pray. Pray. Okay, let us pray. Our Father. Okay, in the name of the Father. <laughs> nice prayer. <laughs> a very, 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 very fast, very fast. But you know, he's prayed like, Our Father, please bless 
Ogoki TV in the name of Jesus Christ we pray and believe. Amen. But same same Father bless other people in the name of Jesus Christ. Eh? Amen. Uh, guys, we have to call it the end of our today's video, guys. I say bye bye for now. <laughs> Let us meet in our next video. Say bye bye. <laughs> Please subscribe, guys, to Ogoki TV. Ogoki TV. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs>